It has been reported that Kakao Entertainment is considering CJ Group as an ally in acquiring SM Entertainment shares. If a large chable like CJ Group decides to participate in the stake purchase, the SM Entertainment management dispute is expected to intensify as it will grow into a confrontation between Kakao plus CJ plus SM Entertainment management and Hybe plus Lee Su Man. On February 14, according to Investment Banking, IB, and entertainment industry sources, Kakao attempted to involve CJ in the dispute over the management rights of SM Entertainment. Kakao is already the second highest shareholder of SM Entertainment with a 9% stake in the company, but Kakao is planning to purchase up to 19. Nine percent of SM Entertainment with CJ through a paid-in capital increase or tender offer, while buying shares held by institutional investors such as KB Asset Management. Kakao is considering offering shareholders a higher price than the 120,000 South Korean one, 94. per share proposed by Hybe in the event of a block deal or tender offer. This is being interpreted as Kakao's move to win over support from minority shareholders of SM Entertainment. Previously, Hybe announced that the company would take a public bid for a 25% stake in SM Entertainment at 120,000 South Korean won per share. Kakao is also counting on the influence of minority shareholders in Align Partners, led by CEO Li Chang Huan. Align Partners is considered a partner of Kakao in this dispute and expressed a negative stance on Hybe's tender offer price, stating that 120,000 South Korean won per share is too low considering SM Entertainment's future value. It is known that CJ has been paying close attention to the acquisition of SM Entertainment since early 2021 when Lee Su Man sought to sell his stake. CJ was on the verge of taking over SM Entertainment, but before closing on the deal, Lee Su Man demanded that he maintain his existing role and be treated like a vice president of the group and the negotiations ultimately fell through. CJ has been continuously discussing the acquisition of SM Entertainment even after the acquisition negotiations fell through. This is because the company predicts that SM Entertainment's K-pop intellectual property IP, will be able to create synergies with CJ ENM's music business. CJ ENM is the largest general entertainment company in Korea but was evaluated as lacking in intellectual property in the music field compared to its competitors. With the recent management dispute between Lee Su Man and SM Entertainment and other competitors such as Hybe and Kakao showing interest in SM Entertainment's management rights, CJ is also paying close attention to the situation. However, it is uncertain if CJ will join the battle to obtain management rights of SM Entertainment. This is because of CJ ENM's financial situation. At the end of last year, CJ ENM's net debt was 2. 
12 trillion South Korean won, tilde used 1.7 billion, an increase of 3.6 times from 2021, and its cash ratio also decreased from 63. nine percent to thirty one point two percent large-scale investments are required and there is much public interest in the acquisition of SM entertainment additionally the parent company CJ group must make the decision whether or not to build an alliance with cacao during the acquisition battle not a subsidiary company like CJ M. A high-ranking official at CJ emphasized, we are not considering acquiring Cacao and SM Entertainment, and we have no plans to do so. Somehow